In honor of your last name, Moore, an M word to describe you, Lauren, is motherly. You are always like a second mother to me. You have supported me unconditionally my whole life, and you'll be the best mother someday. You are so selfless and put your family and your friends first. I had huge shoes to fill. Teachers called me Lauren all the time, and you are a role model every step of the way. Relating, Derek described Lauren as his rock because she keeps us all grounded and one M word to describe Derek is memorable from the day I met him Derek is the life of the party free spirited and go with the flow he and Lauren bring out the best in each other they are so confident when they are together Lauren's true beautiful self shines through Those of you that don't know me, I'm Cole, Derek's best friend. We first met back in high school, but didn't really start to get to know each other until we started working together at Wawa. The first day Derek started, I thought to myself, oh man, here we go. I could hear him all the way across the store even when he was trying to talk quietly. <laughs> he was the talk of the store too, because during his first day of training, he was in the deli and an order came across the screen. Well, the person training Derek had left him unattended for just a moment. Big mistake. But he did as he always does and jumped into action because of his go-getter attitude and tried tackling that order. Luckily, the manager made it back in time as he was wrapping up the order to inform him that cream chip beef does not go on a hoagie roll. <laughs> and it was at that moment I knew I was gonna be very good friends with this idiot. Now, I never said Derek was the smartest man, but the smartest thing he ever did was asking Lauren to marry him. Over the years, I've gotten to watch you grow and mature into the man that you are today, with some help from Lauren, of course. You are a kind, fun-loving guy and an even better partner. From the moment both of you started dating, you have been the very definition of a power couple. So when she finally said yes in the most magical place on earth, I knew you two were destined to be together for the rest of your lives. It is surreal to think that Laura and I were planning our futures via the MASH game for years, and now they're becoming reality. Imagining life without Lauren is like imagining wine without chocolate. <laughs> Lauren and Derek, I love you guys more than Lauren loves sneakers and Derek loves his own hair. That he got done, <laughs> that he got done twice this week. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, <laughs> oh, 
my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> We see here that a wedding is a special thing. It's a bond between two people, a man and a woman. At a wedding, we all dress up and we come to bring our respect and show our loyalty to that union that's about to take place. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? My wife and I. Lauren, if Derek and you have freely, deliberately chosen each other as partners in this holy estate, and know for no just cause why you should not be united, please join hands. I, Derek Moore. I, Derek Moore. Take you, Lauren Fell. Take you, Lauren Fell. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forth. To this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. And in sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do we part. Till death do we part. Lauren, repeat after me. After these words. I, Lauren, fell. I, Lauren, fell. Take you, Derek Moore. Take you, Derek Moore. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do we part. Till death do us part. Derek, place the ring on Lauren's finger. You say, I give you this ring as a token of my love. I give you this ring as a token of my love. Lauren, place the ring on Derek's finger. And say, I give you this ring as a token of my love. I give you this ring as a token of my love. I for now pronounce you husband and wife. Derek, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Waiting for the moment to arrive Waiting for the moment to arrive I was waiting for you And I wouldn't miss it for 